Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What does CI stand for in law enforcement? In the context of law enforcement, the term CI is often encountered, particularly in cases involving criminal investigations and prosecutions. A CI is an individual who provides crucial information to law enforcement agencies. Role of a CI. A CI is typically someone who is facing criminal charges themselves and is persuaded by law enforcement to cooperate in exchange for potential leniency or other benefits. This cooperation can involve providing information about other individuals or organizations involved in criminal activities. Activities of a CICIs may be involved in various activities, such as arranging controlled buys of illicit substances. In these scenarios, the CI will interact with the target individual while being monitored by law enforcement. The CI may also be required to testify in court as a witness for the prosecution. Confidentiality. The identity of a CI is usually kept secret to protect them from potential retaliation. However, in certain cases, the court may order the disclosure of the CI's identity if it is deemed necessary for the defense of the accused. Motivations for becoming a CI. Individuals often become CIs to mitigate their own legal troubles. Law enforcement may offer reduced charges or other incentives in exchange for the CI's cooperation. However, it is important to note that the police do not have the authority to guarantee these benefits, as the final decisions are typically made by the prosecutor. Risks and consequences. Becoming a CI comes with significant risks, including the loss of personal freedoms and the potential for dangerous situations. CIs may be required to engage with dangerous individuals and could face retribution if their role is discovered. Legal implications. The information provided by a CI can be crucial in securing arrests and convictions. However, the defense can challenge the use of this information and may seek to disclose the CI's identity if it is relevant to the case. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.